Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Gemmo DIY. Uh, what are we doing today? I'm continuing the candle wick project. Yeah. Uh, several weeks ago, I made a video because this candle wick uh, got completely lost in there. I don't know where it is. It's completely gone, right? I tried digging it out. I tried melting the wax with a lighter. That's pretty complicated, yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to melt the wax here uh, in this kind of portable stove, right? Got this uh, pot with water. I'm going to just stick the candle in the water, boil the water. I'm hoping the, ma the wax is going to melt enough so I can stick this wick, you know, all the way in to get a nice wax coating. Then I'm going to clamp it, right? with these chopsticks and rubber band it together to make sure it'll hold right uh, until it dries yeah so wish me luck this is today's Gemmo DIY yeah uh, I guess I'm just gonna do that yeah and then I'll just do one side uh, and then when I stick the wax in there Hopefully it'll be alright. Now I hope I don't burn my face off. Whoop. This is going to be... I don't think I'm going to burn my face off. Okay, now I need to get another pair of chopsticks so I can kind of dip this wax, this wick, sorry, which is just a piece of string basically. I don't know, is it going to work? I am not sure. Hopefully. Hopefully it's going to work. I've got that little knot on there. I can grasp it or lift it with some chopsticks and stick it in there. Right. Get it going. This is a Yankee candle for all of those people from the United States. Yankee candle. It's a candle company, right? Uh, in America, in the malls, in every mall, or what used to be malls in the United States. I can even actually see it melting a little bit. Uh, yeah, and uh, we'll see, we'll see. Hopefully it'll work. more minutes been going for about three minutes three to four minutes yeah let's see what happens I'm confident yeah now it's getting bigger the the space between the glass and the wax is bigger can you see that I don't know if you can see that I can stick the chopsticks down between the core wax and the glass Not right yet. We're still going. We're still going well. Yep, we're still going. I'd like to get the black, the, the wick down into the candle core. Oh, I can't even push it. It's a solid piece. I mean, I would like to get it through, right? So then, and that's the whole problem. I mean, maybe the other wick was on top only and it burned off. I don't know, this might be a little bit longer than I expected. It's melting more and more and more as we speak, you know, as we go on here. I mean, it'll be worth it to do this. This is kind of a cool project, right? Can you see it? I don't want to tilt it up. I'm going to mess it up. It might all oh, spill out! No, we don't want that. Three more minutes. Yeah, now it's been an additional three minutes, so maybe we've been doing it about seven minutes. That's my guess. Made the wick uh, long enough. Uh, I'm gonna tie another, an additional knot on here, actually. 
I made the, w the wick long enough so it's going to go through the whole candle. So we've got nuts on, knots on both ends. I'm going to dip it, the whole thing down into the wax and then I'm going to pull it up and clamp it on to the chopsticks like thus, like so. And wait. It's not going to, I don't think it's going to be ready today by any means. I suppose I could let the wick go to the side, but I do want to do it directly in the middle. I'm one for symmetry and evenness. I think the the I think the gas, right? The propane is boiling away. We still have a little bit left. I might as well just use it all. It's for the project. to grab it so I can pick it up, but to no avail. It just keeps slipping out of the chopsticks. Yeah. Maybe I'm almost ready to stick this wick in. This is just a little bit of a candle. I think it's a candle. Fry line. All I know it might be something that the wax was just based in. Yeah. I can't pick it up. It's just slippery as all get out. Ooh, ow, ow, ow. All right. I'm about to stick this, oops, this wax in there. Okay. This wick in there. Sorry, I'm about to stick this wick in here. All right, here I go. I'm just going to stick it in. Boom. Precariously put this over, right? While I gingerly, <laughs> God, I guess I can. I don't want to. Don't want to stop it quite yet. Okay. I'm going to turn it off in a sec here, but I want to get these, this rubber band started around there. So I need to squeeze that wick in there so it doesn't fall down. And then I'll be back into the same position I was. Here we go, turning it off, grabbing it, sticking the rubber band on that end. Yay. Done. Done. We did it. So let's stick that wick down in there. Move it slightly to the center. That's it, gents and ladies. That's it, everyone. That's it, people. We did it. We put the new wick into this candle. Wow. Another Jimmo DIY project. Almost completed. I'm not sure. Got the new wick in there. It's all, all that we can say now is that it's in there. It's still liquid. I'm gonna have to give it like a day or two to solidify. Then we can use it, and then we'll see. Okay. So of course I will show this uh, continuation of this project. I'll show the results as we go along, as we move along. Next time on the wick replacement project on Gemo DIY. Thanks for joining us.
Yeah. Kind of don't want to go quite yet. It's just, it's, it's good. I've accomplished it. Hopefully I got enough wax on there. On the candle. I dipped it in there. Dipped it in there a few times so the, the wick has uh, some wax on it. So it burns, yeah. We'll see, we'll see. I guess if it's not a proper wick, it's just going to burn the string and then... Uh, anyway, we'll see. Hopefully it'll work, but again, I'll be back with you to show you the results of this wick replacement project next time on Gemmo DIY. See you later.